Now here it is. It's leaner, it's smarter. It comes with blind spot radar technology. Its looks are more aggressive and it comes with a brand new engine and a 30 liter fuel tank. It's comfier than ever with heated rider and pillion seats and heated hand grips. It comes with hill hold control, ABS and traction control, under seat storage and a USB charging port. Now let's delve a little deeper into this majestic machine. Look out world, Triumph means business. Well, that's what this new Tiger 1200 says to me. The earlier 1200 first introduced in 2012 was considered to be a bit of a porker and not the sharpest tool in the shed when it came to off-road touring. Let's take a brief look over their new 2022 bike to see some of the serious work Triumph have done to place their new bike at the top of the pile as Triumph's new king of the jungle. Now I say brief look as there's so much going on with this new bike that I'd have to do a two hour video in order to cover everything that this adventure machine brings. Now Triumph have stated that the intention for this motorcycle was to make a bike that felt like the Tiger 900 but offered more in every respect. The Tiger 1200 Adventure range comes in five different models split into two categories. The first category houses the Tiger 1200 GT, the GT Pro and GT Explorer. And the second category houses the Tiger 1200 Rally Pro and the Tiger 1200 Rally Explorer. Now we will be focusing on the Rally Explorer today by explaining the different features this bike offers compared to the other models in the Tiger range. Many would consider the Rally Explorer to be the top of the range because it comes with more features than all the other variants. However, for the average Aussie like myself, it is probably going to be the GT Explorer that is best going to meet their needs with the ability to set a 830mm seat height. I will have a follow up video on the GT Explorer at a later date. So, like the Tiger 900, the Tiger 1200 uses the T-plane crankshaft design. Triples are famous for delivering thick, syrupy mid-range torque and then in the upper revs a frenetic top end rush. That's what Triumph's T-plane crank delivers in this beast. The engine drives to a 6-speed gearbox using an up and down quick shifter, easing your gear changes into an all new low maintenance shaft drive system. And the new exhaust system on the Tiger supports the agility, performance and mass centralization of the bike whilst also being designed to be slimmer than the old 1200s which makes it easy to fit luggage around the pipe. The Tiger 1200 has had significant weight loss surgery losing 25 kilos of weight compared to the previous model. The all new twin sided tri-link aluminium swing arm is 1.5 kilos lighter and the tubular steel frame has lost 5.4 kilos to the previous gem. This model also offers bolt on aluminium rear subframe and pillion footrest hangers. Now moving on over to an integral part of any adventure motorcycle, the fuel tank. The Rally and GT Explorer models come with a 30 litre tank which gives you up to 600 kilometres of range and the GT, GT Pro and Rally Pro models offer a 20 litre fuel tank which delivers 400 kilometres of range to help you explore what Australia has to offer. Now to continue on with the features that our Rally Explorer differ from other models, we are brought to the wheels. The Rally models feature tubeless spoke wheels with a 21-inch front and an 18-inch rear wheel which improves your off-road riding significantly, especially if you run into any pesky rocks or fallen trees. The 21-inch front wheel gives you the space and radius to roll over these obstacles with ease. The GT models feature lightweight cast aluminium wheels with a 19-inch front and an 18-inch rear. Now, another factor to help you roll over those pesky obstacles and improve rider comfort is the impressive suspension and brakes Triumph have on offer. The front suspension houses show a 49mm semi-active damping upside down forks with 220mm of travel. The rear suspension is a Showa semi-active damping monoshock. Now, the suspension system automatically sets sag for rider size and payload. Riders can control the front and rear suspension damping selecting from 9 predefined damping settings. Now all models have Brembo front and rear calipers featuring Megura radial cylinders and optimized cornering ABS. Moving on over to the very important and highly asked question, what is the seat height? 
Jumping into the dimensions of this magnificent beast, the GT models have a 850 to 870 millimeter seat height, and the rally models, as seen here, have a 875 to 895 millimeter seat height. The seat height can be lowered by a further 20 millimeters to 855 millimeters with the fit low seat option accessory. Now I am 5'11", 180 centimeters tall, and can fit my feet on the ground. However, I would choose to drop the seat a little lower for my own personal preference. Now to continue on with the dimensions for this motorcycle, they weigh in at 261 kilos wet, their handlebar width extends to 982 millimeters with the handguards on, and the overall height of the rally without the mirrors and using the adjustable screen height on low is 1487 millimeters height. Now moving on to that fantastic engine. The Tiger 1200's engine shares its 1160cc capacity and design with the Speed Triple 1200. But it is still classed as a new engine thanks to being equipped with a shaft drive and tailored specifically for use in the Tiger model. This machine's maximum power output is 148 horsepower at 9000 RPM and the maximum torque produced is 130 newton meters at 7000 RPM. Now let's have a brief look at the extensive technology available on these bikes. First off, we have the all new blind spot radar technology fitted to the GT and Rally Explorer models exclusively. The blind spot radar offers two advantages. Blind spot assist, which lets the rider know when another vehicle is in their blind spot, and lane change assist, which gives the rider a warning if there is a vehicle approaching as the rider is changing lanes. This is a luxury most high-end cars now enjoy and is a game changer for motorcyclists keeping safe on our roads. This bike comes with a new multi-function instrument panel, including the class-leading 7-inch screen display with a new graphic interface. The only thing it doesn't have is Netflix. This instrument panel comes with a MyTriumph connectivity system for smartphone operated navigation, music and calls, Triumph's unique GoPro control system, and it includes up to six riding modes, which control the bike's character to suit the rider's preference. This includes throttle response, ABS, optimized cornering traction control, and semi-active suspension damping settings. This model also comes with hill hold control which prevents the bike rolling backwards when setting off on a steep incline. It also comes with tyre pressure monitoring system. The GT and Rally Explorer come with standard fitted heated rider and pillion seats and all other models have the option to fit these as an added extra. They also feature illuminated switches, underseat storage with a USB charger, adjustable electronic cruise control, keyless ignition, a handy center stand, and of course, heated grips. Now the luggage system is another collaboration, this time with Gibby. There are two offerings, the Expedition package along with the Trekker package. Now, a couple of standout features the Tiger 1200 range offers after purchase. The service intervals are at a whopping 16,000 kilometers or 12 months, whichever happens first. Triumph have also backed their product with a three year unlimited kilometer factory warranty. The Rally Explorer comes in three different colors. This color that we're looking at is matte khaki. It comes in sapphire black and Snowdonia white. Now let me throw you back to that good looking fella with the cowboy hat. Now we've managed to secure the beast here only for a short amount of time before it bursts out of the doors onto the open trail. Now there is one other place that you can see this animal and that is at our new Triumph showroom on Parramatta Road. So come on in, throw a leg over and experience it for yourself. I'm Tom from Bike Biz Motorcycles and I'll see you in the jungle.